Hello students and welcome to another science online class. This is the video number four for the topic nervous system. Okay, so we will continue our discussion about diencephalon. So diencephalon is divided, divided by two main parts, the thalamus and hypothalamus. So in continuation, hypothalamus regulates homostasis and basic survival behaviors such as feeding, fighting, fleeing, and reproducing. Okay, so this is an example of a brain, a human brain. So, so let's uh, put some letters here in the photo and then identify those parts of the brain. Now, let's discuss the spinal cord. So, the spinal cord conveys information from the brain to the peripheral nervous system. So, the spinal cord also produces reflexes, which is independently of the brain. So, ito yung mga impulses na hindi na dumedirecha sa brain, kundi sa spinal cord lang. So, that's what we call the uh, uh, reflexes. So, a reflex is an involuntary response that is processed in the spinal cord, not in the brain. So, when we say reflex art, okay, it is an involuntary and nearly inst in instantaneous movement in response to a stimulus. So, a reflex again is made possible by neural pathways called reflex, reflex arcs, which can act on an impulse before that impulse reaches the brain. So, mula sa receptors in the skin, going to the afferent neuron, and then interneuron, afferent neuron, and then going to the effector, or an example is muscle. So, this is an, another example of reflex art. So, look at the yellow dot. No? Ayan. So, that's how the reflex art uh, React. So, this is the knee-jerk reflex. So, every time na tayo pupunta sa doktor, and then kapag nirequire tayo magkaroon ng knee-jerk reflex, ayan, our hamstring muscles and quadriceps, quadriceps muscle will move our, you know, our feet, no? Palabas. So, peripheral nervous system, or PNS, consists of different nerves and ganglia. Okay, so the PNS transmits information to and from the central nervous system and regulates movement and internal environment. So, the PNS, afferent neurons, transmit information to the CNS, and afferent neurons transmit information away from the CNS. So, those are the different between afferent and afferent. So cranial nerves originate in the brain and mostly terminate in organs of the head and upper body, while spinal nerves originate in the spinal cord and extend to parts of the body below the head. So kanina, nag-focus tayo sa central nervous system, ay naman po tayo sa peripheral nervous system, which is divided into two the afferent neurons, and afferent neurons. So, we say afferent neurons, these are sensory neurons, while the afferent neurons can be somatic nervous system and the autonomic nervous system. Autonomic nervous system is divided by three divisions, sympathetic, parasympathetic, and enteric. So, the somatic nervous system carries signals to the skeletal muscles, which is voluntary. When we say voluntary, we can control this. So autonomic, autonomic nervous system regulates the internal environment in an involuntary manner. So we can control of this type of process.